Hey guys, welcome back to episode 3 of Hollow Knight playthrough. Last episode we... Oh, I should rephrase that a little bit. We're picking up from last episode where we just killed the false knight. Our very first boss in this game. And we also gained a new power. The ability to shoot with using our soul. That's there. So we tap circle, conjure a spell to fly forward, burning those foes in its path. The spirit requires soul... Blah, blah, blah. So instead of holding circle to drain and make health, we press circle to shoot. And it's really cool. It does, I'd say, about three or four slashes of damage, depending. And it travels through all enemies. So that's great as well. So there's a big line of enemies. But I have an idea for this episode, which is what we started doing last episode is exploring the green path, which is just up to the left. Since now, since we've got the soul. I forgot what it's called, the ability to shoot. We now have a way to defeat the guy that was guarding the place. The one thing with the green path is we do not have a map for it. The calligrapher is not there. And I've done a little bit of research. You find the calligrapher in each area as you explore it. So you can kind of use him as a gauge on when you're more or less done with an area. More like, you know, the main part of the area or when you're supposed to access the next area. So. It's kind of weird. I fell down there by accident, but now we've got all the soul we need. That's the ability we unlock, the ability to shoot. It travels in a straight line across the screen, does it go up or down, and kills more or less every little non-boss mob in its path. Except possibly for some of the bigger guys. And this is a green path. You can tell by all the hedging. The overgrown plants, etc. I hope everyone's doing okay today. Me and myself, I've been shopping. I actually went and done some grown up things today. I got some bell peppers to add to. Whoops. Went and got some. Well, I got garlic, bell peppers, and. What else did I buy? There was something else on the way. Oh, shallots. And that is because the I'm making myself some bolognese tonight from using some fresh beef mince and chopped tomatoes out of a can and a bolognese sauce. You're from Britain, you know the most popular brand. Starts with a D. It's always got those strange adverts with puppets in them. Ah, the new enemies of this area. Pretty good. Those adverts, it's the Dolmio adverts for those who didn't know. I don't know why I wasn't saying the name. I thought it'd just be edgy and cool, you know, cool teen. But I'm not a teen anymore, so I can't be edgy and cool. Oh god. Oh, and he explodes. I like this last episode, I've forgotten already. I wonder if we called it yesterday, but there you go. I wonder if we can kill those. I don't really want to waste a soul shot on them because I want to try and gather soul from these enemies. But I'll definitely waste that on him though. We discovered that you can knock that one into the bubbling acid and he does not explode, he just uh, dies. Probably a horrible pain for death to be honest. Up here. Oh! Just noticed the guy move there. Three times. You gonna do me like that again? Okay. Let's go. I didn't see that, I was too busy looking down. I heard it as well and I was like, is there an enemy? The music here seems very different, more upbeat and relaxing. As does the area, the areas of flowing waterfalls and overgrown buildings and things I suppose. Oh, a safe spot! Nice! We've updated the map, which we don't actually have for this area, so... I don't know what we updated. No? Nothing? Okay. Chuck, chuck. I like to explore in these games, you never know, there's always hidden nooks and crannies. Yeah, so I went shopping today, I got myself garlic, shallots, for those who do not know what shallots are, they are those little tiny, you know what an onion looks like, it's just a, like the small version, well, who is that? Way to presume, you're an enemy? They're scared, get back here. Can't make that jump, great. Let me guess, he's going to charge out here, no? Oh, he's guarding something, no? Uh, 
range on that is phenomenal. You can always presume these little nooks and crannies in the levels have those at it. <laughs> or some sort of overshield. It's over health it's called. Aha. For those who watched last episode and the episode before, the blue you know the blue pods would destroy the little bugs escape and then we kill the bugs. Those are it's called overhealth on the Wikipedia, so that's overhealth. I was calling it armor, but you know. Oh, that's a new enemy. Or is it? What oh, hist? Oh god, that is a new enemy. Oh, okay. Destructible platforms. Or movable platforms, I guess. Oh. Ah. Wait, can we kill the enemies with them? Oi! Oi, fight me! Come fight me, come fight me, come fight me. You know what, I win? Didn't eat anyone up. You scared of me, you know who I am? Oh shit, it's the Hollow Knight. That's. Oh yes! Oh no. Back in there. And goodbye. <laughs> Oh no, did I ruin my jump? That's a cool wee trick up there. Oh, calligrapher! This is paper, but first we'll just do this in case we fall. Oh, it spikes as well, oh, that's great. There he is, the man himself. Or the bug himself. Isn't this a contrast from the crossroads? Such a humid, lively place. The roads twist and turn in the most wonderful ways. I've done my best to chart the area ahead, though I must admit some of the area inhabits some of the area's inhabitants proved quite a nuisance. But I'm after this area for 60 geos. Yes, or oh, geo. We got a map, boys. That's brilliant. Oh, no, no. But get away from the calligrapher. I don't know if the NPCs can die, I would presume not, but let's not take a risk here. Kinda need him. He's the most important character in this game so far. Anywhere we can go in here? No. Strange. Oh, so if you fall in the space, you get reset. Okay, that's cool. Oh, right. So now we can make this shortcut. Walk on the. Both of you. One of you will do. Oh, he's gonna explode, is he? No, he's gone. You don't get geos when you kill them like that, though. I suppose it is easy mode, you just, like, annihilate them from existence. Got it. <laughs> I like that. I don't know why I'm cutting all these. I suppose it provides something. I'm scared. Ah. Okay. Can I feel better about that one? Then go and see what's over there. You piss off. I thought maybe that would blast the door open, you know, but no. Ah! Wait. I wasted all of that there because I went go circle. Yeah. yeah, so quickly to finish off the story, finally, which was, I went to Asda today, I, which is just local shopping centre like Tesco or whatever. You know what, it's just a shopping centre. It's not even a shopping centre, it's a giant grocery store. But I bought fruit and veg for cooking since I decided to start cooking finally. I mean, I say cooking, there's nothing too fancy about browning some mince and adding some tomato and garlic to it. But you know, it's a start. It's a start. Oh, there's a woman. Oh, goodbye. I was more distracted with the big fat guys. I think I moved too fast for that. I think that was supposed to be more impactful. Like, oh, who is she? But we're finally catching up with her. Finally catching up with her. That's good, I suppose. I want to go down there. That oh, seems scary and deadly. Yeah, let's do it. Back off, yeah, big. Still deadly even unless it explodes. Oh. Those who stray from the White Knight's Road shall face the law of Un or Un. Un. Okay. Yep, fuck your path. Run around. Oh, what's that? Oh my god! 
You had that. What? The... We can't reach that, so we avoid it. Oh, dead guys down here. That's pretty sad. It's a tent. And they're dead. And the tent's still up. Oh, that's creepy. That's one of those things. Can we hit this one? No. It hides from us. Right, pussy. Do we hit those back? I don't know. Shoot me. Oh, we can! Ow. Yes. I'm the best. That's a fitting death. I'd love to have something of that at home. Oh, what is that? Oh, thank you. You finished the gap. I don't want to kill that, those things just provide a usefulness. I suppose if we touch them we'll probably get damaged since everything damages you in this game. Do we want to keep going down the way? I mean, it seems spooky down here. No, let's keep following that girl. We'll come back here later. Oh, do you know what? We're here now. Stuff it, let's go. Some fog canyon. No, 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 no. I want the green path. Green path, not fog canyon. Fog canyon seems spooky. Green path. This is nice and gentle. You are gonna ferry us across because you are a kind bug. A good bug. Thank you. Maybe get go there though. I don't think we're supposed to come down this way. Great. I mean I made myself um bolognese the other night as a tester and I was quite you know, it was nice, I got the tomato and the mince and stuff cooked properly, but it kinda... I undercooked my spaghetti, so... Spaghetti. So, it ended up coming off a bit dry when next... Oh, a bench! Nice. Both come down here. Let's see what the map looks like now. Perfect. Anything over here? Yeah, so the spaghetti came off dry, and it was nice. Don't get me wrong, it was a nice food, plus the time I'd spent cooking it was about half an hour. Standing over something for half an hour just made me absolutely starving, so it tasted absolutely amazing. But, I want to do it again. And this time not ruin it with, or not ruin, not ruin it in a sense, but not ruin my spaghetti. And I learned, well I didn't learn, I kind of like to, after it's finished cooking, mix the spaghetti into the pan with the bolognese so it all comes out as one big thing instead of having spaghetti and then bolognese on top on the plate so you just get a plate of spaghetti bolognese but it's it's different from how my dad used to do it my dad used to do you'd get a, you know the, there would be like a well of spaghetti on the plate and then the bolognese would go in the middle of it and then it would be up to you how you ate it whereas the way I'm making it it's just all in the one and you can basically put your spaghetti and bolognese in a bowl for instance and just eat it in a bowl instead of on a plate I ate it on a plate, but you could put it in a bowl. I'm just trying to make a visual. Make it easy to visualise. Oh. Okay. A lot of enemies in this game. Oh my god. So you come out behind me every time. Or as far away from me as possible. You let Stop fucking. Right. I don't know. Oh, squat. Is there any sort of, like, beastery? I wonder what these two things are with. I mean, we upgraded this. Now it's got like a little. This game's very good at hiding its spoilers from you because when I was looking in inventory in the first episodes, I never noticed that little notch above, unless it wasn't there. So there could be more spells relating to the circle button. But I'd hate it if like every one of the spells was, you know, hold circle for this amount of time or, you know, triple tap circle, double tap circle, stuff like that. Oh. You asshole. Time wasting enemies, really. Stop it! Fuck off! <gasps> this is there. There's stuff over there, I want to explore. No, I want to explore over here first. Stop baiting me. Oh, enemy. Give me the soul. Thank you. Up here. Uh, uh, I'm gonna explore. No, I'm not. I'm gonna go chase that woman. We'll explore. We will. We've got a map. We'll know where we've been and where we've not been. Aha! Uh -huh. Hey! You down here? Where'd you go? 
This way. That little dude came out of the wall. Ow, how did that hit me? Why am I getting chased? Go away! Some fat worm piece of shit. What's off? Thank you, Kim. Thank you, Kim. Oh, there's a bench there. What is this? A tool? Uh, yes. 50 cents. 50 geo to access the bench. Give me that. Oh, the map's a pretty. I'm gonna jump down, have a look. Right. So, she must be at the top of this. That, uh. No. Is there anything I'm not down here? Oh, yeah. Money. This will pay for the tolls. Well, some of it at least. 18 plus was it 3, so 21. Almost half. Pretty good. A few of these enemies will make it up. So, there we go. Basically, cost us nothing to open that toll. I don't know how you wouldn't have 50 geo when you got to there. As geo doesn't seem to be that, like small amounts like that don't seem to be. I mean, I even bought the compass and the quill. Not the compass, the pinpoint waypoint marker. I forgot what it's called already. Oh, it's, I've got it equipped. Why don't I just look? It is called the wayward. I was right, it's a compass. It shows you where you are. I'm going to save again because it gives us health. Why not? So now we know we've got a bench coast. That looks like it's been held up by something. Right, I'm not tangling with this dude. Oh, kill him in one hit! He's dead. Oh no 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 no. Right, there's always tails for the enemies in this game, which is good to learn. And I'm gonna hate falling off there. Like, when those guys are gonna shoot, their eyes light up. As if there's like, you know... It's a tail. I'm sick of falling off that ledge. Let's just go. This way, this way, this way. This game is seamless to, to navigate. I mean, I mean, it seems as if I'm fondling about and falling off stuff, but it's very nice. It's very fluid. Would recommend this game. I got it for ten ninety nine on Steam in British pounds, so what thirteen dollars? Probably around about the same price in dollars. You could probably get it on third party sites cheaper, but I'm not gonna. You know, one day we may be sponsored, so I'm not gonna say a word yet. Oh no, I forgot about that. If any of you guys are new around here, any feedback would be great. Even if you comment and say that my, my video is rubbish and I should stop making videos altogether and you know, I'm the worst person in the world. Tell me, and, t and if you're going to tell me something like that, at least tell me why. The greater mind once dreamed of leaf had cast these caverns so, in every bush, in every vine, the mind of un reveals itself to us. I thought it was like a poem at first, so I started reading it nice and then it wasn't a poem. Ah, you're an enemy. Aha, I knew it. Oh, you've got... Are you a boss? No, you're not. you got a shield, though. Hey, stop that. That's rude. Wait, can you deflect bullets? No. Oh, he's dead. But I did use my overpowered shot of destiny to kill him. He took a lot of hits, though. That would have been annoying. Because I'd learn how to fight those guys. No doubt he won't be the only one. Think about it. Oh! Each area seems to scale with dif difficulty as well. So like it starts off nice and easy. Like, oh, wait, there's, there's, there's area up there. Like, there's no, that's not a ceiling. See, I'm hitting the ceiling here. I'm going right up here. But it's not only up. See? I'm going up. There's something there. Or maybe I'm just tripping. I don't know. Do we think she went to the special room on the left, or did she keep going up? I'm thinking the special room on the left. So, I'm going to the special room on the left. I should probably look at the map before I pick a destination. It's probably a rule of thumb from now on. She seemed to run, maybe she's got something for us and she just wants to lure us into her area, I don't know. That does look like a... No, it doesn't, there's two exits off of it. Oh no, that's the, that's the rule of un. The law of un, or un. I don't know how to say that yet. We'll just say un since it sounds better, but it's spelled un. That's going to break. No. Can't make that jump. Um, there's a slab there, but I can't make the jump. Uh, where do I go? So she's foiled me with a, a, a gap I cannot make it across. I can jump 
any one of the caterpillar. Caterpillars, triangle. Right, looks like we're going up then. Oh joy. Oh, he's back. Ah. Oh. Die with it. Oh, you spat. How dare you? It's rude. Ow. He's a good shot. I'll give him that. Oh. Oh no. You piece of shit. Stop shooting. It's rude. It's disgusting. Stop spitting. Stop it! Stop it. Suck at this. He baited me. Oh no, I'm gonna die. Don't die, don't die, don't die. Run. Uh, the bench. To the bench. Hey, where is the bench? Ah, oh, it's better as well. Is there not easy mode enemies down here somewhere? Oh no, one's here. I know there is. Can I get hit? If I, hit, if I get hit, I die. I think we respawn at the nearest bench, which is the one under this room, so I'd rather. No, no, no. Stop being a pussy. And I died. Stop being a pussy. Dies. I should have remained a pussy. Oh, the map updated. Yay. Now I need to go get back my soul. Or. It's me. Fuck off, you big puffy piece of shit. Oh, I didn't think I was making that jump. Where is it? We're looking for, like, me. But without the helmet. Ow! That's rude! Stop being such a good shot! Stop. Why is the music just turned weird? Why is there, like, this, the shining? Help! Mum! Oh, it's me! Give me my fucking geo back. There wasn't a guy up there! Why didn't he spawn? Oh, I could have got soul and healed. Oh, I see the guy with the sword and shield, I'm gonna kick his fucking head in. Charge me. Charge me. Thank you. We're going right. I might have said left earlier, I just realised that. We're going right. Here. The. Fucking. Tiny. Dude. Oh, right, so he double hits. Or oh, if you're behind him, he single hits and then stops. So sometimes if, he, if you make him change. So he can change enemies and then he'll spit you too far away. Stop fucking spitting! It's rude! That hot. Wow, I didn't expect that was good, eh? One, two, so the best way to do it is to hit his shield and then jump. Oh no, because then he'll just jump back. Don't you dare spit. It's rude to spit. Your mum told you not to. Stop. Why am I dueling with this guy? He's like 10 times. Oh, he's dead. I won. Get fucked. He's like 10 times the size of me. That little dude does not look scary at all. It's just got his little sword that he. I thought he even, does he even have arms? Oh, he does. You can kind of see him reach for the sword and then swing. Okay, that's pretty cool. Uh, you guys might not see it because um, my monitor is 144 FPS, so I see stuff. Oh, this place looks yucky. Still the green path, but it looks like a banker version of it. Oh! Forgotten crossroads. I think. Seems the forgotten crossroads. I wanna go that way. Oh, oh. Go away. Go away. I'm not taking any risks here because I'm not walking all the way back every time. Not the map for this area. This is not a forgotten crossroads. It couldn't be because geographically we're on the left hand side of the world. We haven't came back that far, I think. Oh, it's our spikes. Oh, no. oh god. Go away. That's one thing to note, uh, every time you hit something, it prepares you back a little bit. Which is also good for when you jump over gaps. Oh, you little bastard. Could be. I don't think the calligraphers reach this area, so we'll just wing it for now, see what happens. 
of snow on it. Nope, not making that. We are missing an ability that allows us to jump or move or something. Did I skate over it by chance? Mm, I'm not sure anymore. Right, so we can't go that way. Went up. So we need, I suppose we need to go down again. Well, we'll go left and see what happens. Since we're, yeah, we'll go left. We need to find more people. I think there must be NPCs not found yet. What the hell? Let him go. What on earth is this? Are you scream at me? That guy looks like me. Does that mean there's more than one of me? Weird. Come on now. Stays well out of range. Stop screaming! What's the enemies in this game? Noise? Or doing something that's not appropriate? Dead. So I guess it's must be a bigger, it's obviously a bigger version of them. It just exploded a thousand bits there. Excuse me, oh, it did. Oh, he stood up. There we go. Hello. Just what do you think you are doing? You dare come between me and my prey? Is it a habit of yours to scurry about, getting in the way and causing bother? Know this, cur, I am Zot the Mighty, a knight of well renown. Cross me again, you'll find out why they call my weapon Life Ender. You rude little bastard! Not interested. Be gone. What? Zot the old mate? Zot the Mighty? Just absolutely rude. He is uninvited from my birthday. It's not coming. So oh, puff. Great, you did. I think we need to find a bench and call it a day. Right, have we been in this room before? Yeah, we <gasps> No, we're not calling it a day. We're on the other side. The jump we couldn't make. Oh my god, the jump we couldn't make. The jump we couldn't make. I just realised where we are. Where is it? Where is it? Where is it? Where is it? Oh, you're guarding the caterpillar. Right, that one was much easier. I think the key with those guys is just speed and jumping. Small caterpillar! Yay! Celebration! That's the jump we couldn't make! Yes! We're on the other side of the room, we can actually reach home that Oh my goodness! We can make it. Let's go, let's go, let's go. There's two of them down there and lots of treasure, but that. Nope, 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 you're not baiting me. Oh, wait, do we need to go down there? No. Where do we go? Oh, fuck. Fuck off. I'm just gonna heal them while this little guy does his thing. Because then I can get the soul off him. No, get back here! Oh, you little bastard. Oh. I enjoy enemies that you can only hit once. Oh, it died. Going this way. No, this way. Hold it. I accidentally know her name from the Wikipedia, but I swear I haven't looked up again. There's a dead me. This is not going to go well. Oh, fuck. I know her name from the trading cards, I also kind of spoiled the game for myself that way. Because after games you get a notification, so I know who she was. I think it's a girl anyway. Come no closer, ghost. I see you creeping through the undergrowth, stalking me. This old kingdom, a terrible thing awakens. I can smell it in the air. I know what you are, I know what you try to do. I can't allow it. I don't even know what I am! Help! Oh! Can 
Can we deflect that back, I wonder? Oh no. Wait, she charged on that thing. So she, de she deals contact damage. No, no, no. Don't do that. Did that hit her? I'm pretty sure it did. No, 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 no. Heal, 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 heal. I hate there's a dead me beside it. Ow. Leave me alone. I wasn't stuck. Well, I was kind of following you, but that wasn't the plan. I was just exploring and then you were there and then you ran away. Why run? You got nothing to hide. You're a murderer. This music is amazing though. What the hell is that move? Right, now I can't get close to her for too long if she does that. She's gonna jump. Run. Run. This is difficult. I'm scared. Oh, I got her. Oh, and then she just spider man's away. Hey! I won! Oh. Taking the moth wing cloak. Press RT to dash forwards. Use the cloak to dash quickly along the ground or through the air. Oh my god. Ow. What? Would it seek to break the seals? They can't they cannot be undone. They must be undone. Let us sleep, little shadow. Return to your darkness. Allow us to rest. The fuck? The hell are these? That looked like the three masks from that temple up on the surface, or close to the surface. That was strange, but we can't go back now. I wanted to use a bench. Looks like this episode's going to be... Oh, so we just dash across things? That's awesome. That's exactly what I asked for earlier. We need some way to jump or move quickly. Can we make that? Oh, we can. Perfect. I don't want to go that way yet. This room's pretty big. I think. Awesome. This is going to help so much with fighting. Shortcut. This looks... Yeah, this is the exit. There we go. We can't go any further than this point though. Still curious to where Hornet disappeared to. Since we know that's our name now. It did come up at the bottom left. Uh, go. So now we have a dash ability. Essentially. And it doesn't cost anything to do it. So we defeated another boss. Two episodes, boss after boss. Lake of Un. Oh no. I just want a bench. No, okay, we'll get in here. Bench? <gasps> a bench! It's that guy! Right, we'll rest up first. That's the guy that was standing in the temple in the first episode. And what we're going to do is clickbait this, or at least uh, make the ending seem better. Because we'll talk to him next episode. So, thank you guys for watching episode 3 of this Hollow series. I'm having a lot of fun making it. And it will continue. Thank you. This has been Profresky, or Gary, whatever you want to call me. And I'll see you all later.